All right, I'm on the hunt for load gold out uh, north of Havasu. There's a pit over there where they've mined quite a bit and pushed dirt around, and there's some other mines up in the hills here, shafts and such. Anyway, I was trying to find my own load source, so uh, going on the periphery and then trying to find uh, parallel veins, and then I saw this monstrosity. First I thought it was somebody who drove up the hill, but it's pretty obvious that somebody dug into the ground and removed quite a bit of quartz material with uh, heavy mineralization and iron in it. So whatever was in it, this entire vein was worth taking. I'm just late to the party, I guess. I spied this little fella on the ground and picked it up with my magnet and stuck straight to it, you can see that it's got quite a bit of gold-colored flecking in there. Now, at first I thought it was, uh, well, at first I thought it was gold, and then I thought maybe it's mica, schist, maybe that's too good to be true, but uh, it's iron and magnetite, and it's got some quartz in there, and it does set off the detector very faintly on the higher frequencies. So I pocketed it and traced the source up to this lovely intrusion. It starts off lighter and then it gets darker and darker and it's got all these little veinlets of material running through it. And here's some right here. Like, uh, it's, it's everywhere. And uh, it's in all the rock, and it drops out in big globs. Here's some right here. Uh, now, before I absolutely wreck <laughs> this uh, outcropping, which does set off my detector in all frequencies and varying levels, and not just in a mineralized or hot rock kind of way, but in a metallic kind of way. This is obviously metal and it's heavy and it sticks to my pick. So at this point, I'm I'm thinking I found a little pocket gold. It's mixed up in other metals, but uh, this makes for a pretty good day.